Hello, welcome to the very first video in which I'm going to show you how to install Kirby on your local machine with the built-in PHP server. The first thing you probably want to do when you want to try Kirby is to go to the try page and then you can either click here for the personal demo which is an online demo of Kirby so you get your own little installation that you can play around with in a matter of just a few seconds but it's just an online version so um, you can pl play with the pages there that we provided for you you can go to the panel you can click through the administration features and you can just see how Kirby looks and feels but with the online demo you can't really do anything with the code of Kirby so you can't create your own templates you can't um, style the website. It's really just about seeing how the administration panel works and how the pages feel and how fast it is. If you went, want to get into developing with Kirby, you should start installing it on your own computer. And for this, you can choose between the starter kit and the plain kit. The difference between the two is the starter kit is a full blown website, very likely, a very comparable to what is um, shown in the personal demo. Uh, so you get a full site with some demo content, with some in images, um, with a fully configured administration panel, and you can click around and see how it works. Um, whereas the plain kit is very much recommended if you start from scratch and you, um, you don't need all of this. So it doesn't come with any templates, it doesn't come with any theming. Um, you start from scratch, there and you add your own uh, HTML and your own styles, etc. So it's perfect for that. For this demo, I'm going to start with the starter kit. So I'm going to download that. Go to my download folder. And um, normally I would probably put it somewhere else on my hard drive and not just leave it in the downloads folder. But for now, we can start um, Kirby pretty much from anywhere. And in order to do this, I'm going to drag it into my terminal. Close the other window here. And now I can start my PHP server by entering PHP dash uppercase S. And then I have to enter the address for it. So uh, it would be localhost and then I need the port number. I just Let's just use 8080. If you already use that for some something else, then use a different port number. Which is important now is that you use the Kirby built-in router for our PHP server, which is located in the Kirby folder and then in a file called router.php. This one is really crucial in order to get it running properly, otherwise there will be mistakes or errors in the installation. So once you entered it like that, just click enter. And then you can see the development server already started. We can now use this address put it into Safari or whatever browser you use to um, run our starter kit. So here you can see it. This is the, the starter kit as it comes from our zip file. And now we can click around, move to the photography page, which needs to load. Here it is. So, and here's a little blog, so we can click around, explore the universe and all the articles. And of course, we can also go to our admin interface, which is located at slash panel. And the first time you open this up, you get to the installer. So with this installer, you can create your own admin account, enter a super secret password, and then log in. And we land in our admin interface and you can see the images are all being created for the first time, so it's a bit faster on the second run. And now we can click around in our online demonstration of the panel. And with this starter kit installed, we can now really get into writing our own templates, configuring the admin interface with the blueprints, create more content, add styles to our website, change the styles of the, the site that we already provided, so it's the full full blown thing. Once you tried it and you are happy with it and you maybe already built something um, and you want to get a license, go back to our website, click on buy, get your own license key, enter it here 
um, enter your email address and then you have a fully registered license. And that's pretty much how you get started with Kirby. Thank you very much for watching. Hit the subscribe button, click on the bell, all the YouTube stuff that you normally would do. Um, we would really appreciate it and see you in the next video. Thank you very much. Bye bye.